but 20% now, we better work quickly, 20% okay. uh, of the stock now has sold out and gone 45 delicious patterns here. We talked just before the show, Sarah, about the angel policy. If we have yeah. our own books at home yeah. or maybe old books, obviously not books that you're, you're reading, um, <laughs> or if you've gone to a charity shop yeah. and you've bought some books, if we make these products, can we sell them? You can, yes, you can. Great. As long as you don't print the patterns and sell the patterns. Right. But the actual physical books that you've made, of course you can, yes. I always put an, an angel policy on, That's on all my That's fabulous. Uh, so, that means, uh, so that means you could be making the monogram special yeah. Yeah. for a new baby yeah. with their initial on it. Yeah. You could be doing that dragonfly there. Yeah. Um, you could be doing <laughs> the heart, maybe for a wedding couple yeah. Yeah. to have. And that's something that they will keep. That's yeah. a great yeah. uh, gift, isn't it? So when we pop our CD rom in okay. is this what we see yes this is what you see it'll come up and it'll say double click to start the program so you, it, it works on um, a PDF um, format um, what I would like to say also is I do give you JPEGs as well so if you want to make it bigger or smaller oh. you can take it into a graphics program but just remember on a monogram if you make it smaller, you, you, it's still going to be the whole book. Yes, of course. Because it, it, it's not going to alter the amount no, of pages. No. But, but if you've got, say, he, uh, I've got a small book yeah. uh, here, um, and it's maybe, I think, oh, no, it's a bit too big, um, you can alter it. I just Fantastic. wanted to say that. Great. Right, so this, this comes up, and if you click on Enter, you'll get the main um, for, uh, screen. Yeah. There is a little um, screen... Um, oh, there's a video. A little video there that just goes through some of the images oh, here that we've fab. got. It, it gives you ideas. Um, there is also a gallery, obviously, that you can look at in the individual things. Lovely. Basically, that's just to give you ideas on decorating them. Some people like them plain. Um, some people like them decorated. It's completely up to you. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, so in the in this side here, you've got your uh, menu. So you've got your instructions, you've got your patterns, you've got the gallery, you've also got help files there, right. which no one ever looks at, but because it's there. so easy. <laughs> yeah, but it's there. <laughs> okay, so if I go into instructions oh. again, you've got a little um, click through that that shows you exactly uh, just a it, oh. it's not something that you're going to be able to follow but it just gives you an idea of, of how you're going to actually do it yeah. if you carry on scrolling down you you've got your full instructions here step ah. by step so you can take it nice and easy great, go Sarah. step by step but also we can print these out then so yeah, if we're course taking you can. this to um maybe for um a school kids yeah. to do um, as, a, as a project at school yeah. you're taking it to your craft class yeah. then you can print out yeah. whatever design you choose that's right so does that go with all the designs like the monograms the shapes the words yeah absolutely all of them um the the, sh the shape ones uh, uh you know obviously a monogram is is a font you know yes. it, i haven't designed that font but yeah. the actual shapes are all my own images Fine. Some of them are from the Tangle Tastic, like the Dragonfly. Oh, right. The Dragonfly. Um, so yeah, <clears throat> you're getting something that is unique there. That's you know? brilliant. So when you when you click into the patterns, you've got your monograms, your shapes, and your words. So like I say, with the monograms, mm. it's um, p one letter per book. Great. You also get the ampersand as well, so you can write that. S and, and A, or yeah, you know, yes. if you want to make a, a, yeah. a whole thing, which yeah. is nice. That's Basically, lovely. because this is a beginner's guide, mm. I didn't want anything that was too difficult no. to, you know, because people get a bit overwhelmed if they look and think, oh my goodness, you know. So um, I wanted I like something. Yeah, That's it's great. lovely, isn't it? Yeah. It's really nice. Yeah. So, um, and I've put um, the the book in the center there with the ampersand it says and mm. the winner is and it's got the um oh, the oscar the oscar, almost. Yeah, the oscar. That's it. so you can you know do yeah. so many things with them if you decorate them in different ways that's, so that's lovely um, such a great idea yeah so um, but also um i i'm sure <laughs> Because you've got that nice uh, frontage, you can yeah. ink the front as oh, well yes, if you yes. wanted to. Uh, um, do if we your get inking, time, so you I'll, I'll show you how yes. to ink the front up. So, mm -hmm. as I say, you've got all the monograms oh, there. I some of them, the some of them, because an eye is obviously only a small yeah. thing. I've, I've added some little hearts and embellishments on, like the L's got one as well. If you don't want the heart, you just don't fold that, that bit. That's right. You know, no problem. Simple. Yeah. So if I come out of there, we go into the shapes. Wow, because remember, and, there's 45 yeah. patterns. I love that butterfly. Yeah. Now, the butterfly, If when you're starting, 
I would suggest you start with the heart. Can we see that? Yeah. Can we see all yeah. of them? Ah, so look at the dancing now if couple. You, if you look in the corner, you'll see at the bottom um, right-hand corner, you'll see what it looks like. Ah. What I've done is I've stretched it. I've stretched the pattern. Yeah. Because if the lines are really, really close together, it makes it a bit, oh my goodness, I don't know a where I'm up to. Yes. And I've also, every tenth line, I've put a red line. Right. It all goes to helping you... Um, and we don't have to go measure because what you Sarah's don't have to done, measure, no. if you can look at the bottom, the very bottom, I'm just going to point <clears throat> my finger there, <laughs> yeah. the very bottom, you can see numbers <laughs> yeah. running along. Um, that means it's all been measured for you. You yeah. don't have to do anything. You don't. No, that's what I wanted to do. There's many, can I just say, there's many ways of doing Absolutely. this. There's a lot of different ways people actually get to the folded part. Yeah. This is the way I do it. And Easy. I wanted to simplify it, Easy. put all the numbers on. So all you're doing is, you don't have to measure. Um, I wanted to make it simple for people who have never done it before. Oh, can I see yeah. that elephant the as elephant. well? Okay. I love Isn't that. It's gorgeous. We've got a sample over there. The I love it. And so have we got an owl on here as well? There's an owl as well, yeah. See, that's a heart with Within another heart. heart inside. But yeah. I would personally start with the plain heart. So that it would just gets you into it. It's a nice, simple Fair. shape. You haven't got breaks in the shape. Yeah. So, um and start, oh, no. we, we're all going to, we've all got to start somewhere, okay? Yeah. And you will get, the more you do it, practice makes perfect. I love the jazz hands. Yeah. Oh, look at that <laughs> Isn't owl. he gorgeous? That's amazing. <laughs> so, that's amazing. Um, you've got oh, a little look. panda, um, the horse. Now, oh, I'm a horsey, nice. but I used to have horses, so um, um, my daughter is actually in that Dubai working How with horses. How long something like that? Oh, is your daughter in Dubai working with horses? Yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> so nice. So, um, yeah, um, well... How many pages? There's 131 pages well, on there. It's about three days or something. Um, not three days, but you could Sorry, probably just... a hold. It just depends. When you're first starting, it's, you know, you're going to be slowly. The more experienced you get, the, the fast. But I wouldn't go fast, to be honest. No. It's all about precision. And because the lines are all there for you, you want to fold as near to that line as possible. So we print each one of these out. Yep. So, yep. and then, so we print them out. Yep. That's why it's good to get good paper. We have got the super duper paper, remember, on the show as well. Um, because you want it to be sturdy enough to be able to fold yes, it. Yes, we're going to we're going to fold it because it's got to slide inside the book. <clears throat> oh. um, you want it, you know, fairly sturdy. Yeah. Um, now you'll see the way I wanted it to be done. So when I first started, you started at the beginning of the book and you worked all the That's way right. through. Now. I, f I felt that not only if you didn't use all the pages, you ended up with a big wad of pages at the end. At the end yeah. I wanted to start in the middle. And oh, I, I wanted see. all the folds to come yes. into the middle because I think personally that that um, balances, balances it out, the book. Doesn't it? Okay? Yes. Yeah, so absolutely. I have created it in two sides. Okay? You'll notice that some of the, the numbers are upside down. So I'll show you why that is later mm. on. But we're going to start, we're starting, uh, I hope that if you're left-handed, it, it might be a little bit awkward, but we're going to go from left to right. Fine. Okay. But we've got that line in the centre. Is that we've where got we that, fold? That's the centre line. Basically... So it, we fold you, here. Yeah. Uh, we're not going to fold the pattern there. That is... Is that what's that? That's where we're starting. Right. Okay. So that's okay. where we're starting. We're going to okay. start I there. wondered what that line was for. Yeah. No, yeah. that's where we're starting. So that is the centre of our pattern. Fantastic. So you look at your book, right, and at the bottom it says 192 pages. Now you've got to double that of because course. obviously there's two numbers on each page. Yeah. So when, you, when you're looking in the charity shop where I get all my yeah, books from, absolutely. look, if you decide what pattern you want or make sure your book's got at least 400, 400 pages, pages is, yeah. is best. Yes. Um, the more pages, the better. Okay. So, okay, this one has got literally 400 pages. Right. So I know that, you know, half a foot, it's 200, so I know I'm going to have yeah. enough. Then you <coughs> so go to the centre of the Then we go book. to the centre of the book, so oh, I need to find 200. 200. Okay, let me just move all this out the Shall way. I? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Shall I take that from you, that uh, book? I'm going to just show... Oh, right, um, okay. Now, because if you see here, this yeah. line reminds you that this has to line up with the top of the page each time. Yeah. Now, obviously, if you've got a really small book, 
This one isn't too bad because it still sits yes. pretty well. If it is very small, you can fold that over, oh, that's okay, yeah. and and s put it wherever Where you it, want. Yes. I prefer the words or the pictures to be higher it, because that goes back to my picture framing days be, where, as an artist because you want more at the bottom. It balances the overall picture more, if you, you have more, more white at so, the bottom. Yeah, so if you have if you're if you're framing a picture, yeah. the bottom of the mount is always bigger than the top. Okay, yes. so I've all of them are based higher. Okay. Fantastic. So I'll just get rid of this little book That's out of the way. Brilliant. Okay, so the very th first thing we're gonna do is we only need a ruler and a pencil. Good. The ruler is really just to help you with the fold, it's not to measure anything. Mm -hmm. We're going to fold in a quarter of a way the pattern. Oh. Don't forget, this is all step by step. Is this the quarter where the arrow is at the top? Uh, no, no, it's got nothing to do with it. You're just folding it. Basically, that's oh, right. got to slide into your book. Oh. So obviously, you're gonna, the spine's going to stop it. Great. OK. So you get your first page, you get your pattern, you've got your centre line, and you're looking for number one. OK? Oh. Just line it up with number one, get your pencil, Make a mark at the top and a mark at the bottom of the yep. first line. Number okay? one, that's what it says number one, yep. The very th the, sorry, I forgot to do the very first thing, is we're yep. going to make a... I don't like to fold the books right into the spine. I like to have them okay. so far over. I just think it balances a bit better. So I'm going to make a mark about three centimetres. This isn't a, a, you know, you don't have to have it three centimetres. It's not based on science. No. <laughs> so we're just going to draw a line three centimetres from the top, the same at the bottom, and that's going to be our guide oh. to where we're going to actually fold it. Yeah. So we're not folding it into the it's spine. Right into, all the, the, spine. Way into no, the spine. No. <coughs> so let's get back to our oh first my goodness, page. Sarah, so we are approaching 40%. Oh goodness, of right, the stock. okay. So you've got your two lines there, you're yeah. just going to make a little where mark, you did just your so three you can see it. Now some people don't like the pencil marks. You can use a, a craft knife and just put a yeah. score with the craft knife if yeah. you want. But when you start, don't forget this is a beginner's guide. Uh, you know, when you're starting out, you'll find that once you get more experience, you don't even need a mark. Yeah, exactly. Okay, so you've got your first line to your first mark, and I put the ruler there, and what I do is lift the page, oh. and with the back of your nail, or the, your nail, just score it, and you get a nice crease. Yeah. Fold it over and crease it, and that's Fab. it. Go to the next one, second mark, bottom line. This is something really good to do if you're just watching telly, yeah. or, uh, but very therapeutic. Yeah. Also something you could do on the train. You could do it on the train. You? Like I say, that the, the more accuracy, the better. Yeah. Uh, do take Love your it. time, yeah. but you, you know, on a plane or whatever, yeah. if you just want to sit there, it's a type of craft you can take anywhere. The other thing that I use is an elastic band. Oh, yeah. Pop it on the side that you're folding so that you can keep oh. everything out the way. That's okay. It's not. Yeah. It's not keep. Yeah, flopping in your way. Yeah. As soon as you've done the first fold, because I was talking, I forgot to do it. Cross it off. Okay, that's the main thing. Cross it off every time you do a fold. Cross it off so you know where you're up to. Well, the worst thing would be if someone rings the doorbell or yeah. someone's on the phone, and then you come back and think, Oh, where was I? Was that yeah. number five or was that number eight? Luckily, because of the way the pattern works, you can slide it in and you can see where you were. Yeah. If you do lose your place, it's yeah. quite easy to see where you were. Okay, again. Can you go to number two? Up to the top of the page. Now, what, this has got the number two is straight below it. That's right. So you make a little mark, top and bottom. Yeah. Cross it off. Mm hmm. Go back to the bottom mm -hmm. and the top. Get your ruler. Get the ruler. Now, I use, for most of the folds, you're going to be able to use a small ruler. If very, you've got a bigger book, though, you yeah, need like a 30 yeah. centimeter ruler. Um, perhaps. A few of the folds, if they're very sharp, you will need a bigger ruler. Yeah. Um, but I prefer to use a smaller one for as many of the folds as I can. Um, okay. So, as I say, because it's only two folds, every page has got the two folds, turn it over, tuck it under. Okay? Fab. So, you just keep going along with that top and bottom. Tuck it in. <clears throat> We're on number three now. So, wow, one. even I could do this. Yeah, it's, you know, <coughs> there's nothing, 
The actual marking is the easy bit. The, yeah. You know, you want to get it though. When you're folding, try and get it as accurately as possible. You will make mistakes when you're starting off. Mm. I, you know, I've made loads of mistakes, but because because it's a fold, quite often you can get away with refolding it, uh, and it'll still look okay. And mm. at the end of the day, it's a book, a pound book from yeah. the charity shop. 50 pounds. That is the pound. great thing. Yeah. That is the main thing I love about this hobby. It costs you nothing, nothing. to do it. Exactly. Um, and but the other thing is as well, if you oh you can carry on, sorry, we're just kind of watching you. Um, <laughs> if you want to then use maybe your art of music and get some of your uh, papers yep. to then cover your book. Yeah. Um, you've well, got elements it. in there as well, yep. then you can make that book completely different, absolutely i've used uh, a lot of because all my cds have backing papers yeah, on yeah. i've used a lot of the tangle tastic cds yeah. um to to back it like i say you can decorate it or not decorate. Or not some decorate people it. just like them yeah. pure yeah um and also i mean for the for people out there who you know think that it's a terrible thing to ruin books if you leave it in its you know, yeah. purest form as just pay. If they're perfectly readable, yeah. you know, yeah, um, absolutely. Because you're not gluing them. You, no, you see, obviously, so. if you start decorating them, then you you are going yeah. to glue them. But you know, I I always think that a lot. I know somebody who worked in a charity shop, and they said that pe because of the invention of the uh, eye reader and whatever, yes, um, people just aren't buying the books now, and yeah. they're just going to landfill. Yeah. So I think personally, it's better it's, to use them. As not something. only are you giving to a good yeah. cause, you're recycling them. Yeah, you know, absolutely. It's, I'm so going to do this. I, this is going to be so <laughs> one of my hobbies, um, one of my crafty hobbies. It makes hobbies. a lovely gift. It you know, does, I think it? It, it's a lovely, lovely gift. Yeah. So, um, you know, or, I'm on number five now. I mean, I'm I'm trying to go fairly quickly, but you want, you do want to take your time. I, I'm going well, to. It just I'm goes to say show that. how. Um, I think number one, it's therapeutic. Number two, the sense of satisfaction oh, absolutely. Will, will make you feel yeah. great. Um, number three, when you see your product that you have made, whether you're giving this as a gift, maybe it's to um, someone with a new home, yeah. uh, maybe it's uh, for a new baby, maybe it's for a new wedding couple or an engaged couple, yeah. um, someone having um, celebrating their anniversary. It would be absolutely spectacular. Someone just to say, "Well done." Yeah, it's like absolutely. you know, the winner is, and yeah. the winner is. I think yes. that's so <laughs> brilliant. Um, it really is incredible. But I love these designs. They are stunning, um, and anyone can do this. Remember, ladies and gents. But also, I think children of a certain age can do this. Um, yes. Yeah, it's, definitely. It's, it is quite capable for children to do it. Oh okay, yeah. I've, I've lost my. I love the owl. Rider. Have you seen this owl? <laughs> Yeah, I've left him playing because hopefully I'll get a chance to ink him up and show you what we can do with him. Do it too. Do it um, too. Why did I stretch like that? Um, I don't know. Oh, I've got it. I've got it's it. lovely. Right. Right. Oh, no. 50% of the stock oh, my goodness. Okay, um, has right. sold out. So what happens is you've got your pattern. You go right the way, following your pattern right the way till the end, till, okay. you, till you finish the first Shall half. I take that, that, yeah. that bit, and I can continue. <clears throat> yeah, no Sorry. problem. Okay, what are you, what are you going right. to do now? Um, right, so this one here, I've done, this is the, the dancers. Okay. Oh, that's nice. All right, so if you can see now, the, the pattern's oh, yes. starting to emerge. Yes. Okay. Yep, lovely. So we've done the first half, I've gone right to the, the very end. If you have pages left over, you can either leave them like I have with some of the monograms or you can cut them out. Oh, sorry, it's that's why we've got numbers on two sides because one is for one half of yes. the book yeah. and one is yeah. for the other half of the book. <clears throat> I see, yeah. so we've got numbers on that side yeah. and then and numbers here. And we've got here. upside down numbers on the yeah, other side. And we're it's not because going when to you're Australia. turning it round. Yeah. Yeah, so basically, I because I want all the fold, I wanted all the folds to come into the middle. Mm -hmm. This time, okay, we've just been doing it that way. Yeah. Okay, wow. we've come to the end, and then what I want you to do is turn the book over and start again. And start again. Now you'll notice that now we still want the arrows to point to the top of the book, which is now yeah, there. Absolutely. So your numbers are upside down, so you can't start with the wrong side. No, you can't. Okay. Yeah. So then you're going to start putting your arrows to the bottom because it's still the top of the book. Absolutely. If you see what I mean? Yes. Yeah. Um, I'm going to have oh, to sorry. pinch my elastic band. <laughs> sorry. Okay. <laughs> okay. Pop your band back on. That keeps everything out the way, so, so you're not damaging <clears throat> any of the. Um, yeah. 
pages. Okay, so this time, instead of lining it up at the top, we're going to line it up at the bottom. And again, and we're start starting again with, with number one. one. Number one. Okay, so we've got a line there and a line there. And again, you've got your, your two marks. I'm oh, sorry, that's right in your way, isn't it? Okay, I'll use, sorry, so I'll use this one for you. And we're going to go back the other way. So that way, everything folds yes. right into the middle, okay? Like I say, there's many different ways of doing this. Um, this is how I do it, yes. you know? Yeah. Um, and I like to, because I'm a designer, I like to figure things out and th how I would want it yes. to, the finished thing yeah. to... To be. And, and you want it also as easy as possible. Yeah, well, that's right. That yeah. was the main thing because it was, uh, you know, I wanted people who'd never done it before. Mm. I didn't want them to be overwhelmed. Yeah. That's why all the actual patterns that I've done are simple. Uh, but that's not to take anything away from how they actually end up because they're, they're gorgeous they, patterns. They are stunning. I mean, when you look at the designs, you would think, how am I going to do yeah. that? Yeah. Well, people, that's right. People have said, you know, oh, my goodness, it looks amazing. I've always wanted to know how to do it, but there's no way. It looks so difficult. It's When you know how, the folding of it is easy. Yeah. The other thing you might, you'll find out as well when you start getting books You'll find that some pages are nicer than others. Mm -hmm. um, some some are very thick and they split, and oh, uh, right. it, you know, so yeah. there are cheap books and yeah. there are, are nice books. Yeah, but, yeah. <laughs> um, so this page here, see how it overlaps the centre. Mm -hmm. um, obviously, that's going to get in the way when you fold it. So all you do is just fold it back. You don't have to, you know, do it in a particular no. place. Just as long as it out of is the way. a way out of the way. Yes. Yeah, that's yeah. that's all you need to do. Um, this is an incredible incredible CD-ROM <clears throat> really really busy for this um, and I will say uh, for your volume one your book folding uh, I, I believe is it oh my goodness 50% of the stock has sold out we're just over halfway through the show Blimey. and half the stock has sold out three four zero nine three nine fourteen pounds is your uh, and thirty nine pence is your price if you're in the Crate and Craft Club. It is brand new today, ladies and gents. You have got forty five beautiful projects here. Projects that anyone can do. All you need is your ruler and a pencil. Yeah. That is it. And an elastic band. An elastic band. Um, and of course, remember, <laughs> you can print out um, all of your designs. You have got um, the full set of your monograms as well. Uh, so one letter uh, per book. You've also got baby, create, home, two types of home, um, if you like, two types of love. Um, if you like, two types of designs of love there. You've got Keep Calm on your collection as well. You've also got your shapes. You've got your two hearts. You've got your butterfly. You've got the dancers. That's what we're doing now. Uh, you've got the dragonfly, the horse and rider, which I think is brilliant. Uh, the elephant, jazz hands. <laughs> the owl, panda and the yin and yang. Yeah. Um, it is all there for you. And remember, if you want to go for your papers, um, your CD-ROMs, uh, the art of music and your tantastic Oh my Tangled goodness, the art of, <laughs> art of Music is limited stock Blimey. Um, right now. Limited stock. Uh, this is the return of this CD-ROM. It is a very good price, though. It is incredible value for money. This should be £15. It's just eleven sixty nine. You've got everything that you need in there. And you've got beautiful backing papers yeah, in there as well. absolutely, yeah. Uh, really stunning. 329851. This is oh, going to be the first alive. one to sell out, <laughs> um, I'm sure. My pencil's alive. It was just know, jumping just, all, just over jumping all over the place there. <laughs> So, so what number are you on now? You're on number, number two, I am on. I'm not, three. No, no, I'm on number five. Oh, no, number I'm five. Number six even. Wow. Uh, I keep forgetting to mark off because I'm on the TV. But um, <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so see, this is how quick this happens. Um, yeah. And again, because we we are not having to figure out, oh, I've got to measure this, yeah. measure that. Yeah. It's all been measured for us. So yeah. literally, you line up your numbers put a little mark on there, get your ruler and fold away, yeah. that is it. I mean, some people, you know, they see a graph and they think, oh my goodness, you know, that just, you know, I've gone number blind, you know, I don't want to, <laughs> to be bothered with it. But because I think as well, because you can see the actual pattern on the pattern, yes. yeah. you, you know, like I say, I've stretched it out for you so that the lines are fairly uh, far apart, so you're not, they're not really, really close and you're getting really confused. Um, but you can see in the bottom corner what it should look like at the end. 
what it will look like. Fantastic, <laughs> and that's what that's what we absolutely that's, yeah, love. That, yeah, that's right. That it's nice so, and easy. Yeah. Um, and so, I mean, basically, literally, if you sat for an evening. And you started something like yeah. the heart. So, so Maybe the first one to start yeah. with is the heart the... has got quite a lot of pages, although yeah. it's a very simple one to do. It yeah. has got more because the, I'll be honest with you: the more pages in the design, the better it looks. Yeah. But obviously, I didn't want to overwhelm people with the first yeah. with the first CD. Mm. The heart has got quite a lot of pages in it, but something like one of the monograms, um, obviously, oh, like the S or the A. Yeah, you could do that in an evening. You know, oh, a, wow. you know, if, if you've got a good yeah. few hours few to hours. sit. You sat you know, watching the telly, you can do that. So you, need, you do need yeah. to concentrate but, a little bit, but, you but know, it's uh, you, you can, can sit at look the table. And, yeah. and, uh, what I do is yeah. I have the music on in the background, like I do when I'm You're doing all dancing. my tangling. No, not dancing. <laughs> <laughs> like I do when I'm doing all my tangling. I like to sit quiet and and sit and doodle and it's yeah. the same with this i like to sit and take my time yeah. but you know like i say you will want to do it as quickly as possible <laughs> yeah. it's just in in you know your nature because you, you're dying to see, to see it how and yeah. uh, the other thing i wanted to say to you is mm. obviously as you're getting further and further across your pattern you're gonna it's gonna get yeah. stuck so just keep folding it so you can get it further in when you come oh, to the end. Yes. Okay, yeah. you just keep folding it. Fantastic. But your first fold, fold is fold. a third it's of about, the... Yeah, it's about a quarter, a third. A third. It, there's no, you know, it's just so, just you, so can you can get, the get equal. it in. If you fold it on the half, you see, because you're starting on the half, that you've got nothing, it's going to fall yes. out of the book. Yes. So you need to um, give it Fantastic. something to sit in there first. Okay. So, so where are we up to? So we're up to <laughs> number eight. Uh, five, uh, Seven. Number, number six, actually. I was, I was, I got a bit ahead of myself before. <laughs> 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 oh, <dear. laughs> uh, three, four, zero, nine, three, nine. Remember, that is the item number for your beginner's guide to your book folding. So that CD you're on there. It is new today. Now I've been told. 70% of the stock Blimey. has sold out. Your Art of Music, remember, the Art of Music CD-ROM, limited stock. Um, remember on the Art of Music, you've got 10 design sets and each set has toppers and matching design, backing papers. You've got tags and bookmarks, A4 toppers, postcards and topper sheets, 3D card templates, and all of your inserts and envelopes to match over 400 printable Images and pages, and that's but, a, a, a you know a small estimate. There's a lot more. There's than a lot that, more but, because if you you're know, talking about your tags and yeah, things like that, you'll absolutely. get a couple of those yeah, on a on one that's sheet. Right. Yeah. Um, but think about the music sheets. I mean, remember, this is coming from uh, the artwork of artist and designer um, our Sarah um, Hallam there. Now, a quick reminder of your Tangle Tastic. Uh, really beautiful. Uh, what's the stock update? Oh my goodness, 25% of the stock has sold out and again you're getting over 400 printable pages. But remember some of those pages will contain maybe 8, maybe 10 things because of your tags um, and your bookmarks, etc. Your, you've also got your top of sheets, your insert cards, your tangle a day calendar, the practice tangle sheets, 10 design sets as well. An amazing price, £13.49, 338 Four seven five. That is the item number to quote if you want to go for that one. Don't forget we've got your super duper paper um, on the show as well. The super duper paper is brilliant um, for, uh, of course, if you want to print out some of your backing um, sheets there and you want to obviously cover any of your books if you so choose to. The super duper paper there is uh, 250 GSM. It is just eight pounds and nine pence if you're in the Create and Craft Club, 166276. What are we going to do next, Okay, Ella? so, uh, you know, you carry on, carry on until... Yeah. Can you pass me the little owl, please? Oh, yay. <laughs> Isn't he gorgeous? He's lovely. He's really cute. So on this one, I did have... Um, did I have pages left over? Oh, no, actually, I don't think I did. Oh, uh, normally, exact. You know, if you have pages left over, you can either leave them in, like I say, or take um, um, a scalpel yeah, and, and just very carefully slit down and one and at a remove. time remove the pages Fantastic. Um, some books are obviously easier than others mm. um, right so what I'm going to do with this little guy is I'm going to ink him up again you know this is mm. purely preference but I wanted to show you how to actually ink it up that's brilliant because when you look at it when it's inked up when you look at it from certain angles it, it will yeah. um, 
change great. colour. But also, even on its own, even you on know, its own, you can see yeah, you can. how gorgeous that is. Yeah, really lovely. But also things like the ribbon that we've got on yeah. show. If you need to keep yes. your book secure and, and together, um, then grab the ribbon that we've got on show. Yeah. Um, and of course, um, I love the fact also, um, can if I just turn this to the bottom here, and you can see that we've got some of our uh, lovely um, gems, yeah. our pearls that we've got on the show as well. So you can use your pearls again to decorate your see, design. With, with that create there, you know, I've combined Great. it with my uh, silhouette cutting machine. Yeah. Um, rather than using a ribbon to hold the yes. book in the right place, I've yeah. used card. Um, so good, isn't so it? So with it being a monogram, even though it's just one letter, you can still make a word, you know? Yeah, of course um, you can. You can write the person's name or birthday or whatever you yes. want. Yeah. Some books need holding in a certain yeah, position, position depending on the fold yeah and um, some books look better if they're squashed in yeah so you'll need a ribbon or something to hold to them. hold them in place um this particular one isn't too bad no. you, can, you can you know it'll it'll sit quite nicely on its own okay so we're going to do um, some inking. so what i'm going to do is oh my just goodness um the book folding uh, with your 45 projects in there uh, very very busy uh it is new today um are we saying 80 percent <laughs> oh my goodness, we're fast oh, approaching thank limited you. Thank uh, stocks. So, so well done if you've got this, 340939. If you do have in this in your basket, please check out your basket. We are approaching uh, limited stock. Uh, 13, 14 pounds and 39 pence is the price if you want to go for this. So we're now going to do some inking. We've yeah. got loads of emails This is where well. our lovely distress inks, which we can't do without, come in. Yeah. Okay, what I've done is I've just folded the... Um, the, pe the, the, bi, the spine. Yeah. Uh, that, and and sorry, one thing the, the I didn't mention, yeah. obviously a lot of people have softback books. Yeah. Um, and they're also a lot cheaper to buy from the charity shop. Yeah, they, they are. You can still do it with, with softback books, um, but uh, obviously hardback books are better for it to stand up. Mm -hmm. But you can actually strengthen. Yeah, you of course know, you, you can. don't think, and especially if you're first starting, use the, the yeah. softback books. I mean, with the softback books, with your paperbacks, um, you can use either heavy duty card stock yes. or use some like, nice cardboard, maybe from the yeah. back of a cereal pack yeah. Yeah. or something, just and to just strengthen decorate it. it. And then just decorate oh, yeah. it. Maybe if you've got your. Um, <clears throat> your art of music uh, backing. Actually, the art of music uh, has sold out now. Oh, well you. done if you've got that. Well done. I'm so glad that we, we were able to get this back in stock. Okay. Uh, right, okay. Oh, so, you're going to put it directly on yeah, there? Yeah, directly from the ink pad. Um, I've squashed, just used my hand to squash the pages together, and I'm just going to go ahead. Uh, because it's the wow. inside bit is is like debossed if you like yeah it's not gonna that bit isn't gonna get inked up so we're just gonna run the ink pad over the top of it and you can just go like push the pages across one way and then come back the other way wow and you'll see it just starts to that's amazing Sarah. <laughs> isn't it good yeah so um look at the difference look at that so now when you look, oh, you'll see the, the color. I mean, it's only very subtle. Yes. You, you won't see it really strong. Yes. Some, of, some of the colors of it, I think the butterfly is a lot stronger. Really but lovely. The other one thing I will mention as yes, well, if on. I can show you with yeah, this book, sure. when you finish folding. Oh, I've got some pictures. Oh, my gosh. Oh, lovely. Uh, when, when you finish folding, this is only what I do, and it's just a tip. You'll end up, because the picture, the pages are heavy, yeah. they'll pull away from the spine. Yeah. So what I do is just pop um, oh, some hot glue. glue in there yeah. and squash it so that it Very holds good. the whole thing up. And it, you'll, I have actually put some in there. So um, to just glue, just once to, you've finished. to hold it, yeah, and it sort of pulls the design back up, if you see what I mean. What yeah. it can do, because it's heavy, it can fall forward. Yeah. So I, I just pull it up and Good that idea. holds so it Good idea, so with your together. glue gun, with your hot glue. Hot um, glue. A quick word of warning, ladies and gents. Um, if you have this in your basket, I would urge you to check your basket out um, because this is limited stock. Oh, 340939. Check your basket out if you've got this in your basket. If you do want to go for this, please be quick. Uh, there's the item number you can see there. It is limited stock, you can see down there. There's your phone number. There's, of course, the website to order. And very quickly, let me just read some emails. Mm. We do have um, some pictures as well. Um, so you're just going to... I'm just going to... Oh. If you want to read emails, all I'm going to do is just start decorating it with oh, a well, few leaves. Oh, we'll watch you decorate while, yeah. while we read some emails. Um, I love that blue guy. Yeah. Uh, good morning, Jackie, Sarah, and all the crew, says Catherine Ayrshire. 
I've been eagerly awaiting for this show for a Aww. few days, as this is something that has really caught my eye. I bought the CD before the show, as I'm sure it will fly. Very good, because it is limited stock, yeah. Kath. Um, I love books and reading, and I have so many books belonging to my late father that are lying in a cupboard gathering dust, Aww. and I just don't want to throw them away. That is a lovely idea, it you is. know. It is, yeah. Um, so this would be a wonderful way of using them and putting them on display yeah. and be able to give my nieces a memento of their beloved Grampy. Oh, oh that's, that's so lovely. lovely. I'm so excited to see the demos and we'll be glued to the screen. Kath, oh. bless you, thank you very much. Um, let's have a look. Nikki from Camberley says, wonderful to see another programme showing this beautiful craft. Hoping that Create and Craft will be showing more of these. I've been <laughs> making these out of pre-loved books for a couple of months and they have made wonderful gifts for family and friends. Here are two of mine I've got three here uh, okay I must have another one uh, which one, which two are, are belong to <laughs> Nikki uh, there's one That's that it. says friends always and there's one that says everyone's love. so proud of what they do that's a lovely thing about it and you the know, flower it's, basket it's look at this look at this flower basket wow isn't that beautiful that's amazing oh. Nikki that is gorgeous that is stunning um, but then look, she's also done this one. Oh, friends always. That. Wow, that's taken a lot of pages. That is that amazing. Has. Amazing. And uh, we've got another one. Zoe uh, says, um, hi, I've been folding for about eight months now. I absolutely love it. Here is one that I have folded. How did you get into it, Sarah? Like I say, my, my son was um, getting married and I was looking for, because I love, you know, the likes of Pinterest and I, I go on there all the time looking for great ideas. Yeah. And I saw um, a book that somebody had folded with the, the names on and I was like, oh my goodness, I've got to do I've that. I've got to do and, that. And yeah. that was it. I was hooked. Yeah, it's <laughs> fabulous. Um, so that's especially for you, Zoe, because you may not have heard at the top of the show um, that um, that's what our, uh, Sarah is saying. Now, Carol from Malvern says, what a brilliant and clever idea. You have yes. just sold my first wedding anniversary gift, yeah. which is paper. Of course. Oh, brilliant. Yeah, absolutely. Of course. Absolutely. Paper is um, <laughs> anniversary number one. Yeah, um, I love it. That's a great idea. Now you see across the land, yeah. <laughs> charity shops are going to be raided. Yeah. Uh, thank you. Keep bringing new ideas. We will. Um, I've got some breaking news. If you are looking um, at getting your book folding CD-ROM, it's sold out. Oh, no. Technically, no, no, no. it's sold out. Um, when we say technically it's sold out, it means it's <laughs> been allocated to people. If you're on the website and you haven't checked it out, I'm going to be very honest with you, someone can still get on the phone and, and take it. Pinch because it. they don't know that you've got it in your basket, yeah. you see. Um, so it has technically sold out. Oh. Let me remind you that we do have our Tangle-tastic. Um, can we have a look at this on the pieces? Yeah, oh, sure. So lovely. There you go. Just oh, pop, pop. look at that. I mean, that's just a, a simple... With a few little die cut leaves, you know. Don't forget, you can use all your die cuts with of it course. and everything. You know, oh. a, a nice ribbon on the top of it. Yeah. Um, Remember, we do have ribbons on the show. Yeah. Oh, that's lovely. Okay, so that um, has sold out. Which uh, well done if you got hold of that. Let's have a look at our tank.